Hello everyone, welcome back to the Fox News Fan today. American says he's alive and not in Ukraine despite Russian video. Cesar Quintana, a 35-year-old father in California, has watched the Russian invasion of Ukraine from afar in horror, unable to visit the warring region to see his two-year-old son taken by his estranged wife. On Saturday, Quintana bore witness to yet another maneuver by the Russians, this time using his passport to claim Quintana died fighting on the front lines, even though he was home in California. Quintana heard about the disinformation spread through a pro-Russian telegram channel from his friend who monitors Russian media. It's pure propaganda, Quintana told the Washington Post on Saturday, hours after a Russian army service member claimed in a video that Quintana joined the Ukrainians fighting in Mariupol and died. Showing Quintana's passport with penciled coordinates, the service member said troops were sharing the location of his body for the benefit of Quintana's family. These are for his relatives, so they will be able to bury him after the fighting ends, the man said in Russian. We are people, and we must remain as such. Quintana theorized that Mariupol authorities aligned with Russians gave them his passport, which was confiscated in December by police when he tried to retrieve his son, Alexander, as Russian troops amassed at the border of Ukraine. His estranged wife, Antonina Aslanova, had abducted Alexander over a year earlier and gone back to her homeland, authorities say. Quintana had hoped to return to Ukraine in March to work out a deal with Aslanova to get the child back to California. But Aslanova took Alexander to Russia, where Quintana fears the boy is out of reach. He might as well be on the moon, Quintana said. How am I ever going to get him back from Russia? This is the end of our news today. Thanks for watching and see you next time.